Hey everyone, it's Ben and Simon here from Palant Digital, helping you get the digital stuff right. Today we're going to be talking about the five biggest mistakes people make when they're running their own Google Ads. So the first thing to note is that Google Ads used to be Google AdWords, but now they've rebranded it to be Google Ads. So when people are running it themselves, uh, why are they not getting the results they want? Why are they not getting the ROI? We see five things time and time again, so it's time to share that knowledge. Reason number one. You're starting without a clear marketing objective. Mm -hmm. So do you want people to do something on your website, sign up, download something, buy a product, or do you want to create more generalized brand awareness, showing them banner ads as they browse the rest of the internet? Uh, do you want to follow them around with perhaps products that they've seen on your website? So there are three different ways of doing it and they need setting up in three distinctly different ways. Reason number two is keywords. Mm -hmm. You want to make sure you're using the right keywords for your product or service. We see lots of different uh, companies come to us and they've got hundreds of thousands of keywords in their ad groups. You probably just want a small list of very concise keywords and we'd recommend you start with the keywords that are actually on your website. If you start using other keywords, you're going to have problems with quality scores. Next is negative keywords. Yeah, so you wanna pay attention to these. These are the keywords you put in to stop your ads from actually being shown to people. Um, so a good example would be, if you are an air conditioning uh, company, HVAC, then, and you're specializing in say, office installations, you would probably want the word automotive or car as a negative keyword to stop people searching for uh, automotive air conditioning um, regassing and servicing from coming up when you're trying to advertise to people for office air conditioning services. Reason number four is using AdWords Express. Okay, this, this is one we see almost on a weekly basis. People kind of getting sucked into starting up an AdWords Express account, which is a, a really great way for Google to make lots and lots of money by having badly very generalized setup uh, campaigns. Mm -hmm. It's also pretty tricky to swap over from AdWords Express or ads, uh, Google Ads Ex Express to the standard Google Ads. Um, so yeah, try not to um, to run your, an AdWords Express account, get into the main account. Yeah. And reason number five is not measuring ROI or conversions. So you need to make sure you know that your Google Ads are generating you a return on your investment. Uh, so how do we do that? We make sure we're measuring it. Plug in Google Analytics, set up conversion tracking and goal tracking. You want to know that every penny you spend can be tracked back to a specific keyword and whether it's making you money or not. Absolutely. So if any of those have resonated with you, don't worry, just click pause on your campaign and give us a ring. We've been Google partners for years and we've got the experience and the knowledge to stop you pouring your money down that Google drain. That's right. So we can help you uh, turn your Google Ads account around and help you get the results that you want. So it's worth highlighting we're here to grow your business, not Google's. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Do give us a like and a subscribe. See you next time.